Hello everyone, today we're going to show you uh, in our Tableau series here how to connect to the uh, ServiceNow business intelligence application and create a, a map, a geographical map for, map for open critical incidents. Uh, this is available for our this is available for our SaaS customers. You have your choice of Tableau or uh, Performance Point enabled dashboards when you deploy. Uh, Performance Point is using SharePoint. So for those customers that use SharePoint or Office 365, uh, that, that's going to be an option that's attractive. For those non-SharePoint portal customers, um, then uh, Tableau is going to be an excellent option for you. Okay, so let's begin by connecting to our data. Okay, um, sign into our Tableau server. First, okay, and then we want to pull data from Microsoft Analysis Services. So we, you only have to do this one time. Uh, it does use Windows Authentication. Uh, via Active Directory. Um, so we're going to do that. Okay, and so now we've connected to our business intelligence application. We have the measures and dimensions. Now you'll notice here that we have uh, in the incident management dimension we can have multiple tables. So we have incident and CMDB. There are different dimensions. Time is also a dimension. Okay, this is multi the world of multidimensional, um, which uh, gives you much faster query time, as you'll see here. Um, so we, what we didn't want to do is our not only our critical incidents. Yes, we want incidents priority critical, um, but we also only want those that are um, in a state of open. Okay, and this is using the out of the box field here uh, within uh, ServiceNow. Okay, so uh, now we've we filtered it down to instance priority critical that are open. And since we want to show this in a geographical map, we're going to need to choose a geographical field. And Tableau will automatically recognize that, which makes it uh, pretty easy for us. Okay, and so we're going to add that into the report. Now, as you'll see, a bar chart would be a pretty ugly way to look at this. So we can use our geographical map. Geographical map is great, really easy to use, um, and we're just going to uh, select all, and then we want to add in the mark labels because that'll give you the number of open criticals. And here we have this hover feature here that shows us um, the incidents priority critical, and we're looking at it by state. So, um, so that's pretty straightforward, as you can see. Uh, many different ways to visualize the data, and we'll cover those in our in our Tableau series uh, going forward. So now we want to publish this work workbook to our server. Okay, we're going to choose the demo site. Um, probably want to give it a less boring name than Book Two. Um, but we'll just go ahead and choose that now. Okay, publish the view. This is putting out on our uh, Amazon EC2 server environment. Um, and there we are. Now, the nice thing about Tableau, and just one thing to point out here as it's publishing, is that you do have the ability to view these visualizations on every type of mobile device, which is nice. And um, what, one of the limitations of Performance Point is that it works on an iPad uh, only. So uh, with, the, uh, with the mobile first strategy here that Tableau has implemented, um, you've got the ability to view all these visualizations uh, from a browser, and here, so here we're looking at, um, uh, you know, in Windows, in Windows Internet Explorer, but it works on every browser type, um, which is uh, great for our SaaS customers in particular. So that's all we have for you today. Uh, very simple geographical visualization for ServiceNow incident management. Please let us know if you have any questions. Contact us via the website or our YouTube channel. Thank you for your time.